see like that. That's not. That's not right. You can't really get the battery up. Gotta be careful, see. man. What would you do? Pull the tab off? I know, dude. See, this is the thing. It's been like a hundred degrees, and these tabs. So these little GoPro batteries have like little tabs on them, and it helps you get them out of the GoPro. Well. The last few trips that we went on, we like tried to pull the batteries out and the tabs just came off. So that happened to two batteries. So that's something that we're gonna have to fix. And then this one's like really bloated. It's like squishy, which we don't want this to blow up. No, that's not the at all. last thing that we want. And if you guys can tell, we only have like a handful of batteries. Ever since the Texas trip, we just, I don't know what happened, man. We got everything, just, we lost everything. And I just put that battery back in there, Cody. And we got a merch shout out. That's not going back in there. Let's do a little good morning merch shout out real quick. Shout out to Ethan. Thank you so much for purchasing a Big Bass Energy t-shirt in white. Thank you so much. If you guys want to check out any of the merch, link is down below, kickingtheirbass.com. Thank you guys to everybody who supports the brand. I really appreciate you guys. But yeah, we are low on batteries. We got to run a few errands. We're outside of Walmart right now. So we're going to go ahead and run in there, grab a few GoPro batteries because we have some Special videos that we're filming this week a few really good videos for you guys So we need some extra batteries make sure we capture everything So if you guys are new to the channel hit that subscribe button hit the notification bell also hit the like button today We're gonna be doing some tackle shopping, but first we got to run inside of Walmart. We're gonna pick up a few batteries By the way, if you do go into Walmart or any other stores, you got to have your wallet So don't be like no one forget your wallet <laughs> in the truck So yeah, we're gonna go in here grab a few things that we need just for filming this week catch up on everything and then Bass Pro is right across the street. So then we're gonna drive right over there and buy a lot of tackle. We have a few videos coming up this week that are gonna be one really fun and entertaining. And Cody's gonna be a star in one of the videos. Am you I? know what I'm talking about. Yeah, on Thursday. Thursday, oh. Thursday, yeah. we're doing it, dude. We gotta do it. Okay. So we have some cool content coming up. Just gotta get prepared and get everything ready. And I think it'd be good. By the way, we're gonna run a giveaway in today's video as well. When we go over to Bass Pro, I'll, I'll talk a little bit more about that. Let's go ahead and get inside of Walmart. It's like a new Walmart pickup thing. You just order your... How does that work? You order it on the app, I guess, and then they have somebody in here go do your shopping for you, and they store it there, and then they bring it out to That's you. That's a lie, Cody. It actually just goes underground, you know, and then goes up under that. Kind of looks like a big elevator. That's actually what happens. You didn't know that? No, I didn't. I feel like, man, I should have known that. <laughs> All right, what are we looking for? We're looking for batteries. GoPro batteries. This is the weirdest Walmart I've been into. It's not down there. Down that way. I see. Oh wait, no, that's fishing stuff. <laughs> for some reason I was looking for, <laughs> for fishing one time stuff. We're not looking for fishing <laughs> stuff. Might need to ask somebody. Hey man. What's your uh go for stuff? I got a Walmart set up. I don't look here. <laughs> How you doing? Good how are you? Doing great. Can you uh you guys have go for stuff? Not Best Buy it is. It is Best Buy. That's the first Walmart I've seen not have GoPro stuff. Yeah. And it. You're just gonna ask random customers where things are? <laughs> Dude, you know what's funny about that? That guy was standing right behind the wall. Dude, you never know nowadays at Walmart. I know. Half the time people don't have employee shirts on. I thought he was an employee too. Because he was standing like behind the counter earlier, yeah. wasn't he? I knew I wasn't going crazy. I was like, oh, my bad, dude. I was like, man, why's this guy playing music on his phone? <laughs> <laughs> At least we're going to Bass Pro now. I just hope they have tackle. Like, I hope they're stocked up. That's yeah. a big thing. But I think they will. I mean, recently they've had a bunch of stuff. We got to get stuff for tomorrow, which is Wednesday. And we got to get stuff for Thursday as well. Yeah. And then maybe stuff for this weekend. So yeah. let's we'll kind of stock up and get everything that we need. I thought that was a real baby. Oh my gosh. Get me out of here, dude. You never realize how weird the Walmart experience is until you just start looking around you, you know? You're like, yeah. what's going on? <laughs> you enjoying this, Cody? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you, you got know, a I smile, love... bro. You've had a smile on your face since we left the car. <laughs> I feel like you're enjoying this. I'm not sure I think sure you why. like the people just looking at you like you're a freak on the camera. I'm like, who is this guy? <laughs> uh, usually, I'd be kind of like... 
I don't know, nervous to carry a Walmart or like a camera inside Walmart and stuff like that, yeah. but I don't even it? care today, yeah. <laughs> this is what it is. Is the mic on? No, dude. Shut up. I completely forgot to turn <laughs> on my up. mic. I'll have to, we'll have to go back and voice over uh, this whole trip. <laughs> are you lying? <laughs> I'm not no, lying, I'm just lying. kidding, dude. I was I'm, just kidding. I'm not lying, I'm just joking. All right, are we gonna get a Bass Pro first or Best Buy? Bass Pro. Okay. Hopefully we don't get rained on. Time to go into Bass Pro, do some tackle shopping. By the way, if you guys like like these vlogs or you want to see some more tackle shopping videos, let me know down below because I want to make some more. Me and Cody were just talking about it. It's like we go fishing all the time and like that's fun, don't get me wrong. But I would love to come film some different content like this. Just kind of vlog around, buy some tackle, organize the boat, organize the truck, kind of show you guys the behind the scenes. Last time we saw a shopping cart, you were inside of it. <laughs> and Alan Bob was pushing you around. Yeah, that was fun. Oh my God. What? One more thing, hold on. <laughs> You're gonna get so mad at me today. Golly. I'm, like, I'm Pescatelli Noah today. I'm not Noah Pescatelli. Oh, a hand basket. See, that's what I was looking for originally. It's pretty dope, bro. I feel like the fly fishing section in here is like uncharted territory. Not a lot of people come in here you guys want me to go fly fishing let me know i feel like fly fishing is something that i'm gonna have to like really practice though like my first time i go out i don't think i'm gonna be able to do exactly what i want so it'd be something that we definitely have to practice but this is just a whole another side of fishing that I've, i haven't hopped into look at that bro what, what a that? g look at that thing is that a joke They got them all backwards. <laughs> Dude, no. So Cody, we're actually doing something today that we need to do for a very long time. And I'm excited about it. What is one thing that we're always out of? Bullet weights. Bullet weights, extra wide gap hooks. So we're gonna get some bullet weights. We're gonna get some hooks. And we're also gonna get like a little tiny compartment, little little box. Yeah. And we're gonna deck it out, so. Awesome. But there's some right here, brother. Perfect. Those, I don't like these. The reason I don't like them, you see how fat they are? Yeah. At the front? I don't know. I just want them flipping around cover. I don't, I don't like that flat head. I wish it was more narrow, but I mean, if we just need some backups, you know what I mean? It's not a bad idea. What are your favorite hooks, dude? I don't think I've ever asked you what you go to. You know what's funny? Like, it's really funny. I think people enjoy this too. When I buy hooks, like, I go with the cheap hooks, man, to be honest with you guys. Unless I'm fishing tournaments, I go with something a little more top notch. But over here in Savannah, Georgia, we don't really have any lakes. All we have is rivers. And I mean, you're trash fishing, throwing around, you know, muddy, nasty water, bunch of stumps. There's a ton of mud fish. And I really don't see a reason in using an expensive hook because, Cody, you know, half the time you break them off. You know, yeah, we lose a lot of yeah, hooks. Yeah, so like when, when I fish on the river, dude, I'm using cheap stuff like this, which I'm not a fan of, but. It gets the job done for what we're doing, you know what I mean? Like, we're just filming a video. If I was fishing a tournament, it's a different story. And you, then you got tro cars, which are some of the top of the line hooks, which will probably get a pack. These are $6 and you get six hooks. Like, yeah, a dollar a hook. you get 14 less hooks, yeah. But then again, you got a hook that's a lot stronger, sharper, and it's gonna be more liable on you. So, I mean, it just depends what you're doing. If I'm fun fishing on the river, I'm probably gonna throw something cheap, right? If I'm fishing a tournament, I'm gonna get more of the expensive stuff. So it's more durable. We will get a pack of these. And these are three extra wide gaps. They don't have any four aughts, so we're gonna go with three. And then with these, since they don't have any fours, we'll probably just grab a pack of fours. They have them. They do right here. Look at that, dude. 25 count, four aught. Extra wide gap for eight dollars. 
that's wild see this is just stuff that we can have laying around bro like this is for the river yeah. you know it, it, i'll tell you it's better to have these laying around than no hooks at all you know for what sure. i mean so get some extra ones and you can't find nothing they're always out of like because we both probably come in here specifically with something on our mind they're always out of that one thing that's that you're thinking about and that's why you need to go to strikeking.com link down below got my discount code um discount link and also lose.com they're out of stock of some things but you might be able to find the juice i wanted to get a couple packs of flukes just to have them that's not the pearl color that i usually use but it's called silver rainbow you know this would be better on like a sunny day in my opinion if i was if it was cloudy out i'd like to use just a regular pearl flute oh my gosh and they have the one thing that we really need uh, so I'm actually going to be placing a huge order on the Strike King website here very soon. If you guys want to see a video over this, let me know. We'll get all the tackle in, organize it, and uh, show you guys some of our favorite baits. But this is one of my favorite crawls. Cody, how many fish have we caught on this dang thing? Man. We caught more fish on this how than How many any packs of those did we go through? We went through, I ordered hundreds of dollars worth of packs. Yeah. Right? Hundreds of dollars, and we used them all. So we've been out, and these are the Rage Crawls and Summer Crawl. Um, these are the four inch rage curls. That's the ones I usually use. So if you do want to get a discount, you can get them cheaper. I don't know why I'm buying these, but I wanted to get some weights and stuff. I might as well get some baits. We're gonna get three packs of these. Summer curl, rage curls. Throw those in there. I'm gonna get like a black and blue color too. This color, blue bug. It's got like blue sapphire on one side and it's got black and blue on the other. That is a fire color. We're gonna get two packs of these. And we'll get one pack of the Okeechobee Curl. Cool. What else do we need, Cody? I'm trying to think. If we were fishing a tournament on Thursday, maybe we're fishing a tournament, maybe we're not. What would we need? I mean, dude, I kind of want to see if they have any black trick worms. That's but your favorite, dude. A lot of that's, times that's they're out. Bait. They might have some right here. Let's oh, see. Oh, I thought those were them up top. See, they got the finesse ones, but those are a little small. Yeah, I like the bigger ones, kind of like. I might be able to rock with these. Dude, you know what? That, that could be some sauce. It's the Cody Special. Is this what you're no, gonna catch like big fish on? It, it might have to like substitute for the Cody Special. They don't have any. Yeah, they're no. like out of everything. So I saw a video where somebody like had a bait in their hand and they were like moving oh. it by the glass. Let's try that. Oh my god. What dude is actually doing? He's turning on it. Look at that. No way. Oh, look at the striper, dude. Look at the striper. Look at the striper. Oh my god, he's going <laughs> smoking. He's coming for it. Uh oh. Oh, that carps? <laughs> That's a good sign. I mean, we got carp, striper. Dude, that striper. This guy? Yeah. He wanted it, bro. Yeah, he was trying to steal some baits earlier, too. I mean, I can need charge double for these for the ones that you might need to call security. <laughs> So we just left Bass Pro. I told you guys we're gonna run a giveaway. I ended up buying a $50 Bass Pro gift card. So if you guys wanna win this, hit the like button on this video, subscribe to your boy's channel, hit the notification bell next to the subscribe button. And listen, I'm gonna add something else to this giveaway and there's no way of me finding out, but I'm gonna trust you guys because I love you guys. Please share my channel with a friend of yours. You know, somebody that even if they're not fishing, be like, hey man, we're gonna go fishing next week. So you better go check out your boy's channel and get to learning how to bass fish just go send you know somebody my channel i really want to reach a million subscribers and i know i can do it with the help of you guys and i really appreciate you um and if you guys could drop some comments down below on some content you guys want to see i think we got some really cool content dropping this week that's just different and i really think you guys are going to love it but uh, if you guys could drop some you know suggestions down below i'll go ahead and announce that last winner Sometime next week, I'll announce this winner. So we're at Best Buy now. We need to run in there, grab a few batteries, and then we're gonna go back to the house. I got a few things I wanna do through the boat, so I wanna show you guys that. So let's go ahead and get it. All right. Anybody says anything, I'm cameraman Cody. All right. Back up. You know what I'm saying? 
All right, we got to find, see this is awkward. Like when I'm holding this camera, this isn't like my old vlog camera. This is like a big boy camera. You know, you got the big mic and everything. So everybody looks at you like you're a crazy man. But we have the GoPro stuff right here and we have the batteries. These batteries are so, what in the heck is this? Max rechargeable battery. I don't know about that. that wouldn't it just hang out the bottom of the GoPro? These are the ones that we need to get. They only have two of them, which I'm completely fine with because look how dang expensive they are. $20 a pop. So we're gonna grab two of these and wait for Cody to go take a Schmedley. All right, so these are the only two that they have, Cody. They're $20 a pop, bro. Okay. But I wanna get them anyways. Yeah. But these are the only two that they have. I am gonna show you this. How in the heck does this work? Oh, that's for the GoPro Max. It's for that camera. Oh. Yeah, Max. It does say Max on it? Yeah. Got everything at Bass Pro, got everything at Best Buy. Now, I'll catch you guys at my house. You guys are probably wondering what the heck this is. Big shout out to ZD Cows if you guys need any carpet graphics or any decals in general or a boat wrap for instance, go head over to ZD Cows, they'll take care of you. They're based out of Atlanta. And here are our new carpet graphics. So I had a problem with mine. Mine got a little dirty, you know, they just get dirty over time, stepping on them and whatever I'm doing in the boat. Well, we ended up getting some cleaner and cleaned them off really well. And it just kind of turned them a weird color. When they're in the sun, they're white, but if I have the cover on, they like turn pink. So I was like, you know what? Let's get some fresh carpet graphics. It's been about a year and a half since we've changed these out. And that's what we're gonna be doing real quick. Got the old Lou's logo. Rigid. Look at that, oh my gosh. You can't really tell how non-white they are until you really stick a new one next to it. And then we have old kick in their bass. Big muscle fish. And that's gonna go in the middle here. So I think we're gonna start off, I think I might start off with the Lou's one. That one's actually already peeling up. If you guys look right here, it's it's been so hot and, and this one's already coming up, so. And the good thing about this is they're the same size, so I can just pretty much take this off and, it, and you're gonna see the indention. I can just slap it right back on there. So let's go ahead and start with the lose one and then we'll get the rigids and the kicking fish. guys we're gonna end off today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it man i i had a good time coach did you have a good time i had a great day it, it was just different wasn't it it was yeah. a good change in pace it felt good just to go out and vlog you know get some tackle get some errands done for the channel and uh more importantly put those carpet graphics on the boat that some i've been needing to do for a little bit finally got them in and they're looking spicy but uh we got this new man cave i ended up cleaning out the garage we got all the kayaks here i've um, got a couple bona fides got my sin bass pro kayak um, got like all my tools, pressure washer, shot backs. I got a ton of tackle back here. And if you guys want to see a video where I go over some of the tackle in my garage, let me know because that could be the basis of another vlog coming up very soon. We have a few killer episodes that we're going to be dropping over the next few days. So you guys better stay tuned for that. I love you guys so much. If you enjoyed it, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. Peace out.